Okay, so we're back again, this time for the full moon on the 17th of October, 2024. Can't remember what the full moon's in. Uh, you'll know better than I at the time of recording this. Um, but anyway, it's good to have a little tidy up and a clear up around the full moon, isn't it? Oh, dribbling. So, um, so set your intention to receive the benefits of this. Obviously, make sure you're 100% open to receiving and uh, let's get started. Yay! So let's have a look then. Where are we on this full moon on the 17th of October, Thursday the 17th? I hope that's the right date. We're at 10% positive and we're at 100 negative, so something to clear there. Where are we sitting in terms of consciousness? It really is incarnation level, so something definitely needs clearing. So I'm just going to ask your high self teams to clear away. We're doing this. This is a kind of tidy up of the energy really around the full moon. Full moons and new moons, they, they uh, light... Uh, moons cast their shadow cast their light on the shadows so it brings a lot of stuff up from the shadow and the shadow is stuff that is unintegrated all those parts of us that are unintegrated uh within our energetic makeup i suppose i did a little video on it about five or six years ago what what is the shadow so if you trawl back it's not an srt clearing video so it's not on the srt playlist but um there's a, like a five minute video on what is shadow for those that are not aware of what it is uh, i did a little speaking video on it um so uh yeah maybe it's six seven years ago now actually time's flown by but uh yeah so the stuff that comes up during moon cycles the moon throws it shines a light on those aspects uh, of the shadow and um, which is why it's nice to sort of clear this stuff out as it's coming up and tidy up so it's what I would call a, a bit of a defragmentation around the moon cycles when we do these clearings a defragmentation of our organic uh, drive our, our minds really just tidying up those loose ends and uh, clearing out stuff which is no use to us anymore it's obsolete so chart 6b which is blocks of positive expression we are clearing out uh blocks to giving freedom blocks to faith that's it so let's just clear those away from all of your energy bodies for your highest good Chart 16. Du, 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 du. Separation from one. Okay, so let's clear that belief that you're separate from one. Let's clear that away from you. Because that's like abandonment. That's a biggie, actually. It's been coming up a lot recently. And separation from love is the other biggie. That tends to be at the I'm level consciousness. Right. Chart 20, chart 21. Let's go for chart 21. Let's have a look. Odds and ends in this one universe. Past lives that the soul doesn't want to examine. So let's just clear those away then. We would refer to them as past lives in linear terms from this lifetime, but actually they can be at any, any moment in time. As most of you are aware of, it doesn't have to be, we don't incarnate in a lin linear level, if that makes sense. We appear to, but we don't necessarily. So it's just other lifetimes that soul doesn't want to examine. I prefer to call it that. Okay. Chart 
Chart 30 final light. Let's have a look. Where are you? Let's be having you. Final light. Okay, it says to wrap up. Anything else on here? The infinity stream, we're going to clear. We're going to do a head to toe search and clear as well. So let's just do both of those before we wrap up. Anything else before mop up? No, so let's go and do a quick mop up for you where the bulk of the clearing takes place, as you know by now. And when I do my personal clearings, I tend to read through a long, complex list here. So they go into a lot more depth. They seem to be taking longer and longer as well. <laughs> I'm going into quite some depth with the personal reading. So you will get, um, when you buy a package from me, you get a, um, a typed up report of your clearings. So you don't have to be in person for the clearings. Um, I do them remotely and uh, then send you a typed up report. And uh, it's a very methodical report. The clearing isn't always methodical in when it, I'm going through it. But when you get the report, the report is very methodical in the way that it's typed up. So sometimes I'm all over the place with that and going from here to there and everywhere, um, asking a lot of questions. And um, so I tend to just uh, give you the answers for basically what came up rather than all the questions and stuff uh, as well. Are we done? Yeah. OK, so where is it now? 100 positive, zero negative. It feels lighter as well. Okay, and we're at Radiant Lovely Paradigm. There you go, another one done, and I will see you on the next clearing, which will probably be next week. And I hope you have a lovely weekend and uh, look after yourselves under this full moon. And I hope it comes through, breezes through beautifully, gently for you, and integrates everything, integrates perfectly. And um, I'm rambling, so I will see you on the next clearing video. Bye all.